Morning, the list of tributes to Mrs. Carter is growing. 11 Alive's Ariana Manise joins us in studio with that. Ariana, this really shows the reach of her impact on the world. And this morning, people all across Metro Atlanta are mourning the passing of former First Lady Rosalind Carter with a number of heartfelt condolences. Over our next, formerly known as Twitter, we've seen messages from Governor Kemp, the Braves, Bernice King, Habitat for Humanity, which was an organization we know that was so close to her heart. We've also seen statements from Senators Raphael Warnock and John Ossoff and so many more. We're also hearing from Ambassador Andrew Young, who knew and worked with her and the former president so closely. Back in 1977, President Jimmy Carter appointed Young to serve as the nation's first African-American ambassador to the United Nations. He's remembering her as a world citizen. She was she was really and truly a world citizen and a wonderful representative of these United States and a tremendous support uh, to her husband. In fact, I don't know that he ever made a decision without uh, whether he asked her or not. He heard her opinion. <laughs> And you can head over to our website, 11alive.com, for a look at exactly how Mrs. Carter is also being remembered by current President Joe Biden, as well as other former presidents and their first ladies. Chesley?